Are you looking for the best accounting software for your business? In today's video, we are diving deep into a head-to-head -head comparison between Zoho Books and Viapar, two of the most popular accounting solutions. Stick around as we analyze their features, pricing, usability, and more to help you decide which is best for your business. Overview Let's get a quick introduction to both platforms. Zoho Books, a cloud-based accounting software designed for small to medium-sized businesses, provides features like invoicing, expense tracking, GST filing, and automation. It's part of the larger Zoho ecosystem, Zoho CRM, Zoho Inventory, etc. Viapar, primarily built for small businesses and retailers in India. Simple GST billing, inventory management, and expense tracking. Works both online and offline. Zoho Books offers a comprehensive cloud-based solution with deep automation, while Viapar is a straightforward accounting tool focused on small business needs. Features Comparison Now let's break down the key features of both platforms, and let's start with number one, invoicing and billing. Zoho Books Customizable invoices, automated reminders, and multi-currency support. Viapar Simple GST billing, offline invoicing, and SMS invoice sharing. So Zoho Books wins for advanced invoice features and invoicing and billing. Number two, expense and GST management. Zoho Books, automatic expense tracking, GST ready reports, vendor payments. Via PAR, GST compliant invoices, tax calculation, and easy tax filing. In this point, Via PAR wins for simplicity, but Zoho Books wins for automation. Number three, inventory management. Zoho Books, multi-warehouse tracking, stock adjustments, purchase order management. Viapar, ideal for small retailers with simple inventory tracking. The winner is Zoho for large businesses, and for small retailers, Viapar is the winner. Number four, mobile app experience. Zoho Books, available on iOS and Android. Cloud-based automatic sync. Viapar, strong offline support, limited cloud sync. So Zoho Books is better for seamless integration, while Viapar is a good choice for offline support. Pricing and value. Now let's talk about pricing, because budget matters. Zoho Books pricing. The free plan is for businesses with revenue under $50k per year. Standard plan at $15 per month. It includes basic features and can be used by three users. Professional plan at $40 per month include advanced invoicing and reports, and it can be used by five users. Premium plan, $60 per month, up to 10 users. Workflow automation includes workflow automation and advanced integrations. Elite plan, it will cost you $120 per month, and it includes advanced inventory, analytics, and forecasting. And finally, the ultimate plan, at $240 per month, it contains premium features plus dedicated support. And of course, when you pay annually, you will get a discount. Via Power Pricing Mobile app, the basic free plan, which has limited features. Mobile app premium at $15 per year. Include basic premium features for mobile users. Desktop plus mobile at $50 per year, including full access, inventory, and invoicing. And the lifetime plan at $100 which is one-time payment. So which one offers better value? Zoho Books is great if you need cloud storage, automation, and integrations with other business tools. Viapar is an affordable one-time purchase for small businesses with basic accounting needs. Ease of use. Which software is easier to use? Zoho Books has modern user interface, but may feel complex due to extensive features. But if you are familiar to Zoho ecosystem, it will be so easy. Viapar. Simple, no learning curve, and great for beginners. So absolutely the winner in this point is Viapar for its simplicity. And for power users, they can go for Zoho Books. Final verdict. So which one should you go for? Choose Zoho Books if you need automation, cloud access, multi-user support, and if you run a growing business and need advanced reporting. Choose Viapar if you run a small shop or retail business and need offline billing. It's an affordable and easy to use option. Both are great options, but it depends on your business needs. So what do you think? Which one is the better choice for you? Let me know down below in the comments and tell me exactly why is it the best option for you?
And that's all for this comparison. If you find this video helpful, please don't forget to support us with like, subscribe to the channel, leave us a good comment, and share this video with your friends. Thanks for watching and see you in a new video.